welcome back to my channel. This is Stephanie Muscle on this Felicity Jam. Thank you for joining me here today. So today is Face Mask Friday. I know it's pretty late. You're probably I'm in Central Time, so right now it's eight eight forty three Central Time. So I'm gonna try to upload this by nine or nine thirty, so I can get a, a face mask in. I haven't had a fa a face mask, or I haven't had any. Yeah, face mask skincare. I've been doing my skincare routine quite a quite a while here, but um. I have not done a face mask for the past two weeks, I believe. I think the last time I did a face mask was, yeah, like two weeks ago. So I want to go ahead and get one in because it is part of my uh, therapy as far as relaxation and getting my skincare, um, self-care, skincare treatment. So let's dive into the... Uh, mask I'll be using today. So for those who are to my channel, welcome. Hi, thank you for being here. For those returning subscribers, I thank you for also being here and supporting my channel. Um, if you haven't done so, please subscribe. Make sure that you check your your uh, subscribe button. Make sure that it's already um, clicked on subscribe and then you have the notification bell on. And then if you can also give my video a like, I really, I really do appreciate it. So in today's video, I will be going and I'm going to go ahead and show you the Crumb Shop Bell. Uh, it's a Disney, uh, Princess Disney mask, and it's made by Korea. It has rose water and hydrating hyal hyaluronic acid, and it says, I want balanced skin. So, I want balanced skin myself. <laughs> um, as you can tell, that my skin has um, dark spots. Um, really, makes, mostly, I'm getting, I just have like. A lot of dark spots and my freckles I like my freckles but everything else I have like dark spots so that's really what I'm battling my that's what I'm battling with my skin is you know having dark spots so you see those two boxes back there we're gonna go ahead and unbox those while I while this marinates on my face so give me one second uh, to put this on but before I do I did want to mention to you the eye patches that I'm wearing is by bio agua these are the peach extract with hexapeptide eye masks and they look clear. They look like I have like a um, like a clear skin or uh, like a clear film like underneath my eyes, right? It only it looks so clear. So I really do like the way uh, that does. I, I really like the effect of that. That they look clear. You, you can't even tell that you're wearing them on. You can't even tell that you're wearing them. So um, I like that, and also I like the fact that they are like the kind that I like they're like the gel eye patches and um, yeah so let's get right to this so I'm gonna take these off here we go so these are the little jelly masks eye masks all right so give me one second I'm gonna go ahead and put this mask on and I'll be right back All right, you guys, so I'm back with the mask on. So on one side, we have a rose that bloomed. It says creme for the creme shop. And on this side, it looks like there's a mirror or it's a rose that hasn't bloomed yet. Or it could be a mirror. I'm not sure. There could be both. It could both be roses. But I think that I thought it was pretty neat. And then there's a saying up here. There's a little phrase up here that says, starting a new chapter. So... I really do like these decorative, these um, animated, uh, I really do think these animated uh, sheet masks are very fun uh, to wear as far as, you know, they're very cute and pretty and um, yeah, they're not boring like some of the ones that are just plain. Uh, you can actually see characters on the mask. That's what I like about these animated masks. But anyways, um... Uh, you know along the properties that it offers also as well along those benefit uh, skin skin care benefits that you need for your face so let's go ahead and dive into um, this first box I have here is by Sephora so this is a Sephora haul and let me see if I can find some scissors Right, 
So I found some scissors, so we can go ahead and open this box up. Hope you guys had a lovely evening, a lovely morning. Hope you had a good day today. Today is Friday, so for most people, it's the end of the week. And we're starting off with the new week. We're starting off with the weekend, and then a new week on Monday. All right, so here we go. What did I purchase? I can't remember what I purchased, guys, but um, you'll be seeing it here in a minute. So here we go. So the first thing I have here, of course, you're going to get your little samples. They gave me the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion sample. Got that. And they also gave me the new HD Skin Foundation by Makeup Forever. Little swatch cards as well. So I'll be putting those to use as well. All right, so the first thing I have here is a Huda Beauty Easy Bake uh, Loose Baking and Setting Powder. So this is something I've, that I've always wanted. This was something on my list of things that I wanted to purchase ever since they came out with this new shade called the Cherry Blossom Cake. Ever since they came out with that one, I've always want I've I've been wanting to I've I've been having my eye on it. So I said, why not get it? Let me just get it now. <laughs> so let me share this with you guys. Okay. Whew. I don't know if I was gonna be able to open that there. So here's how it looks like. This is how the top looks like. It says Huda Beauty. It's square shaped. Wow. And it has a little cover with the lid. It's a lid. Open this lid. Oh, wow. Okay. There's baking powder there. Um, do I see that? Yeah. I. Yeah. That was not how I expected it to, to be. But um, this is supposed to be very good to uh kind of give you like a really light pink you know kind of like a like a light pink color to your skin underneath your eyes when you're brightening your eyes it has a tint of a hint or a tint of pink and it's very you know supposedly you know i hear it's really good you know a lot of a lot of people that have recommended this to um some beauty influencers and if some of them tried them they've tried it and they've liked it as well so I may like it as well it's called easy bake so I'm not sure how it's easy bake there's no no um, no sponge in there I'd have to use my own uh, brushes to use that so I got that and then also purchased well this is a um, this is a sample this is the Lancome Hypnosa Drama Extreme Volume Mascara let me put this in a giveaway, guys. You know, since uh, I have so many mas so full-size mascaras, this is a little mini size mascara. So I'm just probably putting this in a giveaway. <clears throat> the next thing I have here is the JLo Beauty Overnight Facial Inside the Overnight Hustle. HA BHA resurfacer. I don't understand. I thought this was supposed to be a little a little wider than this. Oh no, look. Yeah, okay. This is the right size. I thought it was I was, thought it was supposed to be a little wider. Yeah. So yeah. It says at night apply thin layer to clean dry skin. Gentle enough for nightly use. So this is supposed to be yeah, an AHA, BHA resurfacer, so supposed to be doing good for like uh, fine lines and wrinkles and brightening the skin, you know, so wanted to try that because I do want to, I do have, I do want to get my like, JLo beauty collection together and this was one of them that I was missing that I wanted to get, so I got that and then I also have the the Limitless Glow Sheet Mask Titan Plump Radiant. Oh, by JLo. Yes, there's another one from, from JLo Beauty. It's like, I gotta have the masks as well. 
Um, I'm not sure they're two part masks or if it's just one one single mask. But supposedly they're well, I'm not sure they're really good. I haven't really tried it. I haven't seen haven't seen anybody try these yet. But this is how they look like in this gold foiling packaging. So I can't wait to open that up when the time comes, guys. When the time comes. So putting this to the side, so I'm gonna put it with my face, my sheet masks. So that is what I had for my Sephora haul. Hope you guys let me know if y'all like any of these products. Um, do you like JLo Beauty? Do you like the Huda Beauty? Do you have the Huda Beauty uh, cherry blossom one, the cherry blossom cake? Um, let me know how how it works for you. Let me know if it gives you that really nice hint of pink underneath your eyes when you use it to brighten your skin, to brighten underneath your eyes. The last box I have here is an Alta Beauty shipment. So this is the shipment I got from Alta Beauty. It's light, it's in a big old box. Okay, come on now. All right. The little green air savers. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay, this is more like it. This is something I really I saw on Ulta. I was like, okay, so there's some things that I wanted to get from Sephora that I thought I can. That I, there's some things that I got in Ulta that I wanted to get in Sephora that I thought Sephora offered, but they did it. And one of those things that I thought Sephora offered was Oprah. For some reason, I thought you know, um, Sephora offered. Ofra cosmetic products in there on their site but they don't but I got me this Ofra um, head in the clouds mini mix face palette I really saw like you know like on TikTok and then on social media a lot of the a lot of these You know a lot of those videos that you know that are showing you the new face palette you know has the blush and the highlighter supposedly that they complement each other like the blush complements the highlighter in each in each color we have purple we have a red and then we have a pink so I think it's called yeah here we go so the purple one is called Purple Euphoria, I think that's what it's called, for the blush. No, Purple Aura, sorry. Purple Aura, and then the red one is called that, and the pink one is called that. So the red one is called, oh, it actually looks like an orange, not red. It looks red on camera, but it's really orange in person. So it's called Orange Sky, and the pink one is called Pink Clouds. So I didn't, but it does look red, but it's really orange really orange in person so the highlighters at the top this one with the pink on top of the pink this one's called cloud nine daydream is the one in the middle and then we have fantasy on the on the end here underneath uh, above the purple one so so these are supposed to complement each other so we'll see how that does I think I might have one I think I might have cloud nine and daydream in the full size i don't have fantasy in the full size i don't think i don't, I don't think i do but um i think i might have the other two I'm not sure i have to look at my collection so that's one of the items that i wanted to get off of sephora that i did you know I, they didn't they weren't offering it so i'm glad i got it here in alta then we have this peach and lily brand this is This is the Lazy Day All-in-One Moisture Pads, Hydrate and Revive. There's 60 of them, biodegradable pads. So they're six centimeters in diameter. It must be small. Okay, so let's just look at this up. So what are they supposed to do? They're supposed to be after a long day, after a workout, or when you're traveling, doing your skincare routine, can be the last thing on your mind 
These soft biodegradable moisture pads are a toner, serum, and moisturizer. And when that's why I got it, because it was a toner, moisturizer, a serum, and moisturizer in one. Oh my god, look at this! This is a huge. It is a huge bucket. <laughs> like a little huge. It's a huge jar. Peach and Lily. Okay, so be able to see that. Oh, we got a really good look at that. So that's whenever I have a lazy day and I don't feel like toning or putting serum moisturizer on my skin, these pads will do all the work for me. So, all right. The next thing I have here are two items. These are supposed to be like, they are very, they, they've been hyped up on TikTok. They've been hyped up on Instagram. They've been hyped up on, um, on, uh, on YouTube and these are the NYX professional makeup duck plump so I'm gonna test these out I also got one from Timu that's supposed to be like you know like the um, like the like the dupe for these so I want to go ahead and test them out you know and see if they both if uh, and they both work the same or if I get the same effect you know from either or from if I get the same effect or if it's just you know you know all if it's not really gonna do any effect on my lips you know you know supposedly you're supposed to plump your lips and make them look nice I got them in two shades I got them in the apri the apricot 04 shade got it in this shade here it's like a nice nude shade but it also has like a little hint of peach tone in it. And then also got me the one called Cherry Spice. I think this is one of their newer colors. I'm not sure. But it's uh this 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 looks like it's gonna be like a like really nice like a really spicy maybe tingle to my lips because it does look you know um you know it looks more of a of a um like a gloss type of liquid injection <laughs> lip injection type of uh formula it seems like it looks like a, a sheer clear um formula and this one almost this one doesn't this one has this one looks more creamier so i'm not sure it might they might feel this they it might have the same effect it might be you know um might give me that sensation on my lips that are hopefully doesn't burn too bad but we'll do a try on in another video so that is everything for my sephora and Ulta hauls hope you guys enjoy these i hope you you got your you're enjoying my unboxings and my hauls um if you haven't done so and if you do like if you did like this video please give me a thumbs up please do so. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so. And then hit the notification bell, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and come off, take this mask off because it looks like it's about like everything just, it feels like it's so, like it just seeped into my skin. Like I just barely put it on. It hasn't even been like 20 minutes. Well, it's close to 20 minutes, but still, um, I still feel like it's really like it's drying drying out on me so let's check it out guys how this how this uh feels on my skin how the serum feels on my skin for some reason i felt like this one had less serum than most of the other creme shop masks i've worn before because all the other so most of the other creme shop masks i've worn before always had more serum And this one just sort of feels like it just has just the right amount of serum for those who, who don't like a lot of serum but I love serum <laughs> I love a lot of serum guys so so that's that's the reason why I'm you know a little biased <laughs> you know I love these I love the ones that have a lot of serum those are my favorite but this would be good for, for those who don't like too much serum or like who like moderate, you know, 
not too much serum, but moderate amount of serum on their face. And even the inside, I, mean, I don't even think there's any serum on the inside. Yeah, I don't think there's even enough for me to, for, for me to even use on my face or on my skin. Yeah, I don't think I had, I don't think, I don't think it was drenched with serum. Yeah. Usually, if it was, it would. You know, I still have serum inside the inside the packaging, but it, it only has very little serum. To share it, let me share it because it's gonna. It's already it's already seeping into my skin. I don't know if my skin is just dry or what. Maybe my skin is just dry, and it just soaked it all in. All right, you guys. I do like the way this looks. It looks. It, it makes my skin. Look more refreshed, more um, wide awake, I guess I should say. I feel like my face looks more brightened, more wide awake, more um, more healthy, I guess I should say. <laughs> All right, you guys. Thank you for joining me here today and spending some time with me to see my next Face Mask Friday or my next video. So please don't forget to hit that like button and then also share my video if you can and then hit the notification bell. And please don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe to my channel, I really do appreciate it. I should be uh, coming up with some giveaways. So yeah, so giveaways, giveaway times. All right, so um, yeah. I'll see you in my next video. I love you all. Bye.